Guildford, Victoria is today a small rural town approximately 126 kilometres to the northwest of Melbourne and 11 kilometres southeast of Castlemaine. During the early 1850s, gold was discovered in the Guildford area with rich fields in the direction of Castlemaine and Hepburn. This brought many diggers to the area to search for gold, with a large number of Swiss Italians settling in the area. The gold also brought thousands of Chinese miners to live and work in the area, with some predictions there were as many as 6,000 Chinese living and working around Guildford, Campbell's Creek and Vaughan in the 1860s. Some historians believe it was the largest concentration of Chinese miners in Australia at the time. Hostility towards the Chinese was avert and there were numerous local conflicts. Consequently, the Chinese miners gathered together for safety. The largest encampment was near the junction of Campbell's Creek in the Loddon River at Guildford. Sadly, no evidence of the camp remains today. At the time, it was mostly calico tents along with narrow thoroughfares dotted with joss houses, tea houses, boarding houses, gambling establishments, opium dens, theatres and even a circus. The Chinese worked not as individuals but in a type of cooperative which allowed them to engage in open-cut alluvial mining. Some evidence of the Chinese diggers still exists at nearby Vaughan where a Chinese cemetery is located at the entrance to the reserve. Gold was also found in significant amounts at Vaughan and in 1859 it was estimated 13,000 people were living and working in the area. According to Doug Stone, the region around Vaughan is a great area to prospect for gold as you can both pan for gold and metal detect. There are great campsites in the bush along the Loddon River and you can venture out into the old miners' patches that include names like Murdering Flat, Dead Man's Flat and Grog Shop Gully.